Five o'clock somewhere. Hi, I'm Andrew Johnson. Happy Thursday. You're welcome. This week's topic on queer comics is the Holocaust. Now I'm just kidding. It's first kisses, male and female. And I think it's pretty presumptuous of you to assume that some of us have opposite sex kisses. No, I'm just kidding. That's the world we live in. The default is is opposite sex and, and we need to go out of our way to have a same sex thing. So of course we all have opposite sex kisses. Of course we, of course we do. It's just, it's something that you need to do. Anyway, my first female kiss was when, I don't know, I was like four, maybe five. Definitely not later than six. And it was my next door neighbor. Uh, she was really slutty. I was really curious. I also saw her pussy for the first time. I, I, yeah, in fact, I probably think that that's the first other set of genitals that I'd ever seen, like maybe before, like another boy's penis. I actually think I started to like have like pretend shower time with like neighborhood boys, maybe at seven. But I saw her vagina when I was like at six and I was just like, oh, this, uh, this is different. This, I don't know, better stay away from these. My first male kiss was, I wanna say, when I I was maybe 14. No, I was 16, he was 14. So it was like kind of statutory rape, but like really, we're both going to jail. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? They were both pretty terrible from what I remember. Uh, although I don't remember a lot because I remember being probably really bad both times. Well, of course I was. If I was like, you know, single digits, of course I was. And the only reason I was doing it is because I saw it on TV and like the TV that I was watching were like adult soaps. Like Dallas, because my parents were watching it or something. I probably saw people like kiss on that. And I was like, well, that's what you do. Um, I'm pretty sure that I thought kissing was just like, I don't know, blowing into each other's mouths. Like just opening your mouths and be like, <gasps> like just like forcing air down or something. Because it re really, when you think about it, kissing makes no sense. It makes no sense at all that we join our mouths together and be like, <laughs> like it just... Like, what is that accomplishing? But it's great, it's great, it's great. I apparently have continued to kiss both genders. Uh, at least we have photographic evidence uh, about 10 years ago. Here are two pictures uh, from a Halloween that I was at like about a decade ago. Here is me kissing a woman. Here I am kissing a man at the very same Halloween party. And little background or little fun fact about those, she is now a very high stakes lawyer. He is now a father of two children who he actually wanted and continues to parent. So not only is my kiss restorative and healing, but also um, success delivering. I definitely like kissing. I'm certainly not Julia Vivian Roberts from Pretty Woman, no mouth ki no kissing, no kissing. Because prostitutes apparently don't like to kiss. They consider a kiss, they consider the mouth hole a very personal hole as opposed to their other holes, which are rather impersonal. Actually, when you think of it, it's probably much more, you can probably catch much worse shit kissing someone than you could just like them sticking something in their body inside your, like down their hole. I don't know. Do I consider myself a good kisser? Yeah, I do. Look at my lips. Look at my lips. I've got... Pfft. You know what? Here's the, here's the raw facts. I'm pretty good at most things. Like, I'm I'm pretty well-rounded, you know, I think. You know, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like not like, I was about to say I'm not an Olympian in any, in any facet. However, I definitely am. And we'll have to wait for that topic to come up. I'm sure we'll hit it if we, uh, if we keep going with these queer comics blogs. So, um, yeah, that's it, right? Like, you just kind of wanted to know about, like, the history of my first kiss with, like, a guy and a girl. It was awful. I got better. I understood the purpose of kissing. And kissing's great. And here's a kiss for you.